It is day four of the LAPC. I'm Kimberly Lansing here with David Baker, who started the day off uh, fourth in chips. He's now our chip leader. He doubled up in one level, knocking out one of the chip leaders, uh, Richard Toth. And you say you're lucky. I'm just the luckiest guy in the room right now, I think. Okay, so tell me about your level. Well, I mean, it was really only one pot. He had just lost a big one to Dan Heimiller, and then uh, Dan raises, I call, and we're all in really late position. It's just hijack, cut off button. And then he re-raised on the button, and I'd heard that he was just uh, he was a player that could definitely have bluffs there and, you know, a pretty wide range. So, and just came to me with ace-jack, and I thought it was really, you know, I, I don't know, it seemed really close to me, and I... I don't know, I thought for a little bit, but decided to just roll it. And mm -hmm. What'd you had, have? I had ace-jack, okay. and he had queens, and oh, I ran out of flush. But I know with ace-queen in my spot, I wouldn't even, like, second-guess. So right. I felt really close with ace-jack. But And then you got lucky. Yeah, that's why, you know, I played, it was, like, the seventh hand I've ever played with a guy, and I have to play a huge pot and, like, you know, make a judgment call. Uh -huh. And that's what you have to do in these tourneys. And sometimes, yeah. you know, the breaks, you know, they come. They'll go your way or they won't. But I definitely thought he was folding, like, a good bit, mm -hmm. so... Now you are at Dan's table. Are you sitting to the left of him? I'm on his immediate left. Okay. Now he's uh, he's made our invitational final table, which uh, we're taping on Wednesday. Mm -hmm. How is he to play with? Um, well, I haven't played. I played with him a couple years ago, but uh, I haven't played with him in uh, in the last little bit. But definitely, so far he's been playing. He plays looser than most people and more aggressive than most play people. He plays more hands, but I think he uh, plays him well mm -hmm. and he knows what he's doing with uh, his loose with uh, his image and you know he he knows I don't know I think sometimes you know he looks he knows he doesn't look like a, a crazy young guy and he uses image to make some bluffs yeah. that wouldn't work for me or for other people I I definitely think he plays a really good loose aggressive game. And is this the farthest you've made it in a WPT? I mean, uh, no, I've had a lot. I've had a lot of close calls. I actually just took 27th in the five diamond, like okay. in December, yeah. and I was like top four and uh, got in versus Robo, and that didn't work out too mm -hmm. well. But you know, keep it in the state. We're both from Michigan. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know. I've had a lot of close calls. I think the best I've ever done is uh, 24th, okay. like three years ago. Yeah. So I think I have like five top right. 50. And game. we're down to 47, and mm -hmm. you're, you're pretty healthy now. So Very let's not make now. it a close call. Let's make it to the final table. Let's do it. I'm ready. Nice to meet you. Thank you.